Today, Kevin and I are gonna be trying some Copper's Chocolate. We have had this brand before and it was absolutely delicious. I'm thinking when we found it before, it might have been at like Tuesday morning, but I know Fresh Market always has a display of Copper. Mm -hmm. So if you are interested in this brand, you should go there. You're gonna pay more, but it is very, very good quality. So when I saw these, they were probably out for the New Year's, I had to get them. Uh, they were $3.99 a piece. They are uh, sparkling Prosecco cordials. And mine are sparkling rosé. And these are both in dark chocolate. And what's funny is um, I say that these were probably out at New Year's because I'm thinking that's probably the last time we were at Fresh Market. But we um, uh, tried some cotton candy that was out for Valentine's for the Day. Same flavors. And they, they had the same flavors. We had bought them at Target, and I don't even remember the name. It's a lady's name, and it was yeah. not familiar to us at all. Um, it didn't taste anything like what it was supposed to taste like anyway. Mm -hmm. um, but it's funny that those same two flavors were out for Valentine's Day in cotton candy. So this just looks like it would have been out for New Year's because it has the little um, glass of bubbly. Uh, but this says, bite responsibly. Liquid center in every cordial contains no alcohol. So I wonder why it says bite responsibly, but it contains no alcohol. Be uh, I bet you because it's liquid. Uh -huh. I bet it's liquid and it's going to run over you. Could run be. out. I bet that's what they mean by that. Well, our cordials are liquid. Mm -hmm. It says, crafted daily since 1937, every bite-sized piece of Copper's chocolate is truly a work of art. Pop a shimmering bite of bubbly with these Prosecco flavored liquid center cordials. Uh, these are made in Cranford, New Jersey. Four servings are in the container, about nine pieces, 30 grams is 130 calories. So they're gonna be fairly small. Yes. Teeny tiny. Okay, but you have to be able to get it open. Okay, there we go. Oh, and they are pretty. They're very pretty. Like gold finger. I want a big one. Yeah, some liquid, but it's not a lot. Mm -hmm. That has a lot more flavor than that cotton candy did. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that actually. It's got a crunchy center. That actually would remind you of Prosecco. Mm -hmm. Yeah. The cotton candy we tried was nothing like what it should have been. That actually is very, very nice. Mm, those are good. The bad I don't thing know what that is, center is, I could eat that entire bite. Uh, that is that good to me. It has um, uh, chocolate. Uh, it has uh, liqueur, cocoa butter. Mm, uh, it's it in says the middle. popping candy. No, I didn't get popping candy. I didn't get popping candy. No, but it says popping candy. Hmm. I wonder why I didn't describe it as popping candy, but that's, that is what it's supposed it, to be a little bubbly. It literally says that in the ingredients. Let me see what this It could have been the crunchy bit in the middle. This one's a sparkling Ooh, rose. These are pretty. They're pink. Celebrate purple. anything your heart desires with these delectable rose flavored liquid center cordials. Do you think these could be out for Valentine's and we just got them really early? Maybe. These are. Um, a fewer calories. These were 130 calories for nine. These are 120 calories for nine. Once again, I get the biggest one. I got one little piece of popping candy. That flavor is, is more chocolate than anything. Yeah, but that one didn't say popping candy. No, it must have just been a, like a piece of rice candy or mm -hmm. something that popped. The flavor of that is mostly chocolate. Yes, it is. It is. It's you mainly get the dark chocolate. I don't know if I told you how much these were. They were three ninety nine each, and that's not a bad price if you only eat nine at a time. I could yeah. eat the whole bag. But I still didn't get really popping candy. I'm holding it on my tongue, and you still didn't get it. I mean, um, maybe a little bit, but I thought I got that with the rosé too. So. The rosé just tastes like dark chocolate. Yeah, it's good though. 
It's, it's delicious. I love the textures. Yes, it's delicious dark chocolate. It's not um, overly bitter. It, but it's it's the dark that you want without. It doesn't dry your mouth out. Right. It's really really nice. But I would not have ever guessed that there was anything with it. Mm -hmm. The Prosecco does have a different flavor. It does give you that Prosecco flavor that you're looking for if you're buying this. Um, these are very, very pretty too. I'm going to have a picture for you at the end. Looking. They're Yes, they, these would be beautiful if you didn't want to eat them to just put them in a bowl. Well, um, don't let it get too hot in your house. Well, that's true. <laughs> um, because they are very, very pretty. Mm -hmm. um, I don't know if you would, I guess you're just buying these to eat yourself. Yeah, it's just a special on. sweet treat. Because I can't imagine like being able to serve these at a party or having you them. You could in, put them in a bowl, I You guess. could put them in a bowl. But I don't think you would, I don't think you would normally pay $4 for this little bag because it's really It'll only full to here, to here. And I think that's kind of pricey. But it's, once again, it's very good quality. Mm -hmm. It is. Yeah. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope you can find these, I, you know, and let me know, were they just out for New Year's or are they out for Valentine's and we were just able to get them really early? I really don't know the answer to that. So hopefully you can still find these and thanks for watching.